You're watching Action News 5 at 6. Tonight, the Omicron variant of COVID-19 is a reality right here in the Mid-South. Action News 5's Camille Connor has details on the infected person as health leaders work to determine just how contagious this variant is. The Omicron variant has reached the Mid-South, with Mississippi detecting its first case Monday. Infectious disease physician Dr. Michael Threlkeld suspects the variant has already spread to other Mid-South states, but it's not currently the biggest threat. It's mostly still the Delta variant that we're seeing. We're not seeing um, you know, large numbers of cases of the Omicron variant in the U.S. Health experts are still learning how easily Omicron spreads. Early information from South Africa shows signs that it may be more likely to spread than previous strains. Cases reported so far also seem to be milder, but Threlkeld remains cautiously optimistic. Uh, we don't yet know what it's going to do, say, in an older population of transplant patients or somebody that's immunosuppressed that may be more susceptible to it. Uh, some of the populations, particularly in South Africa, have been in younger individuals. The patient who contracted the Omicron variant in Mississippi was fully vaccinated and recently traveled from New York. The Mississippi State Department of Health says the patient has not been hospitalized. Dr. Threlkeld says getting vaccinated remains the best defense against the virus, though just how well it protects against Omicron is still being determined. Overwhelmingly, the message I want to give people is get that vaccine because once we're all vaccinated, we think that that will help prevent the spread of the virus to such a degree that these variants don't occur. Otherwise, we may expect to see other variants. Camille Connor, Action News 5. 